The treehouse she shed looks amazing. Amanda got the walls finished, put the ceiling up, and even got started on the kitchen cabinets and the bed nook. I'm thrilled. But I have an idea that I think will really make this shed pop on Airbnb. This is a treehouse, and it feels like a treehouse when you're in it, but I really want to give the idea that it's literally in a tree. We'll give it a try. We can find out here in your backyard, right, down trees, big, huge branches yeah. that have fallen off. And there's also the dogwood that we had to take down in order to put up the she shed. OK, All let's right. find it, and okay. then we'll get to cutting it up. Being able to use the dogwood tree that originated in Amanda's backyard for this piece is so cool because it fits the theme of this she shed. It's natural, intentionally used material that won't go to waste. This is the dogwood tree that we took down. Aha! Uh -huh. So that's oh, an it's option. great. Not only do we have to trim this dogwood down to size, but we also have to trim off the leaves and branches and somehow get it up the stairs and into the she shed. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, whose idea was this? Not mine. I don't know. This might actually work. You doubted us? This isn't the first time we've shoved a tree into a house. <laughs> <laughs> OK. All right. Now what? So I think I just need to sort of move the tree around inside and, and see what makes sense and fits in with the design, but doesn't actually get in the way of people. Hey, Sarah. Hi. Today, Bob and I went, we found this old 100-year-old reclaimed wood that he used to have on a barn here. And we turned it into a brand new, beautiful coffee table. Check it out. We built that with our man hands. With our man hands. Yeah, yeah, OK. Check this out. What do you think? Wow, worst Christmas tree ever. Hey. Call me if you need some help, all right? Peace. Bye. Check out your pirate shed. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> this is amazing.